you'd like to come and find yourself a space and let's just warm the shoulders up so just lift them to your ears for me and then I'd like you to pop your fingertips on your shoulders and we'll do single elbow circles that's it and then we're going to do both elbows together so circling both those elbows and again do single single for me and then both together that's it a little bit of coordination so single single and both together that's it okay so from here I'd like you to reach up and bring the arms down and then reach up and bring them down perfect so just reaching up and bringing them back down so this next time we're going to lean over to the side so I want you to lean over to one side and then over to the other side so just however feels good for you that's it now if you want to take that arm I'm taking my arm in front at the moment if you want to take that arm over your ear then do that's it okay come back to those elbow circles then so elbow circle and then we'll do them both together and then do them again one at a time and then both together perfect one last time that's it lovely 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 okay so this time we're going to take it into a bigger circle so just single arm circles here and just again checking in with those shoulders okay so I'd like you to bring those circles forwards so we're just warming up through the shoulders that's it just feel a little bit like you're swimming and let's take them both back together so both back together now I'd like you to get some movement through the chest now I don't mind how high or low your arms are as you're double circling them but what I'd like you to do now is I'd like you to start to pull your elbows down that's it that's it so again not worried about where your back is just get that moving that's it perfect so just rest that there so give the arms a bit of a shake and then I'd like you to just take the foot back foot off the floor and just turn and rotate from one side to the other just allow it to flow that's it it's quite a nice rotation here so looking over your shoulder look over your shoulder that's it last time here and last time here okay so nicely warmed up through the shoulders so what I'd like us to do is to go back to that circling that we did so fingertips on your shoulders and then circle those elbows okay so now take your hands off your elbow shoulders and circle those elbows now we're going to do both together so as you're doing these elbow circles I want you to start thinking about pulling those elbow circles back down behind you so elbows pulling down so as you start to take your arm circle bigger that's it starting to pull those elbows down so lift the chest and open the back of the shoulders so we've got quite a lot of movement going on here that's it so last one perfect so if you're sitting or standing it doesn't matter I'd like you to put one hand on your lower abdominals and the other hand on your sternum on your chest and I'd like you to think about where your body is so when your hands on your on your abdominals here just think about lengthening your tailbone so if you're sitting in the chair you might need to help yourself up and just sit up a bit taller so hand on your lower abdominals other hand on your sternum and just think about length between these two points so we're not arching the back or anything like that just think about lengthening the tailbone down and the chest up so as you've got that feeling there so you don't want to be rigid though just think about being tall so I'd like you to take that arm circle again but I'd like you to focus on standing tall and as you circle your arms pull your elbows down for me pull them down so as you see you're pulling them down into a sort of a W position so last one so this time we're going to raise the arms up into a V and pull them down into a W and this is going to really help to get your upper back and your shoulders so I'd like you to take your arms up into a V and then pull them down into that W so reach up 
and then pull down. That's it. So reach up and pull down. So as you're pulling those shoulders, those elbows down, reaching up, shoulders away from your ears. As you pull that elbow down, notice how you feel that your rhomboids and your shoulder blade are sort of coming down and being tucked into the back pocket of your trousers. Or you could think about a guy rope on a tent being tightened as it pulls your shoulder blade down. So as you reach up, you keep the distance between your ear and shoulder here. As you pull that elbow down, you feel that you're really pulling the back muscles here and pulling down into the back of your of your jeans if you're wearing jeans. So reaching up, pull those elbows down. Now if you're finding that difficult, you can take it to the wall and take your arms up and then slide your elbows down the wall. And that will really target that upper back and those shoulders. But when you do that, then keeping your, the front of your body nicely switched on and engaged. So this is just being a bit mindful about the upper body, the upper shoulders, the, the mid-back, and, and really encouraging a bit of strength to go on in that upper back. So we've not got any weights, not got any bands, not got anything fancy. It's just taking your arms into that V and pulling them down into that W position. So as you reach up, I'm pulling down. So one more of those and just thinking about that lovely tall posture. So just roll the shoulders out, that's it, and then just sort of sweep the arms across the body. There we go. And just roll those shoulders out and just sort of see how that feels. And hopefully you'll be feeling a little bit taller as well because we've done that. All right, well done, well done.